Hi friends, this is Andy from TechStore and in this video I'm going to be showing you the process to upgrade the RAM hard drive of the HP Pavilion 15 AU series of laptops that uh, HP has launched recently here in India. This is 2016 June and uh, this is the latest laptop that uh, HP has and uh, they have done a brilliant job in terms of uh, putting up the hard drive and RAM at the right place. We'll show you how it has to be done. So see if this is the way your laptop looks like. Uh, silver or any other color once opened if it looks like this that's the way it looks and if the base is something like this then you can apply this particular procedure so you need to have a screwdriver set and you need to have a prior and uh, you need to flip the laptop and uh, base down now you'll see a lot of screws uh, not many to be precise 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 totally 9 screws which are visible as of now and there is one screw that is hidden below this particular rudder here so let's start So these two are hinge screws uh, which are a little longer in length so you have to keep them on one side so it does not get mixed with the other uh, screws. These are shorter in length and thinner in length. Now people who want to just replace the DVD writer just remove this one screw over here and just remove the DVD writer and take a 9mm uh, SATA DVD writer just uh, remove this one screw put it on the new DVD writer and uh, replace the front uh, uh, cap of the DVD writer with the flat cap now coming to this particular portion here you need to take a small little minus pin screwdriver and just protrude a little bit so that you can just remove this entire portion just keep it on one side and then there is this one screw that you have to remove keep it on one side now you need to take a prior and you need to pry the entire laptop start prying from the DVD writer area there will be crackling sound need to pry here too this portion now the base will be off and the base will come off so you see the hard drive and the RAM the battery the processor the fan the CMOS cell the Wi-Fi chip literally everything is bare open in front of you so if you just want to replace the motherboard also just remove the screws we'll not go into that we'll only go into the battery part and the hard drive and the RAM part here so for the first thing first we need to do is remove the battery here so these screws have to be opened and uh, we need to remove this connector which is connecting to the battery and if you want to replace the battery just take another battery this is the power rating as you can see this is BP02XL and uh, the power ratings are uh, 5150mAh 8.8 volts and 7.7 .7 volts and 41 watt hours. This is a 2 cell lithium ion battery. So 
just take another battery and just replace it. Now coming to the hard drive here, the hard drive is connected by a very uh, delicate looking uh, strip here. Uh, we need to remove uh, this strip here. The hard drive will come off. There are these uh, protective uh, coverings uh, near the hard drive that they have kept so that uh, there is no shock. So just remove these, uh, take a SATA hard drive, just remove this particular strip connector. This is a 2.5 inches SATA laptop hard drive that you have to buy to upgrade the laptop. So if your hard drive has gone bad, this is the way to do it. Let's put it back inside. have to put it like this and then just gently push it be very careful with the strip connector here just coming to the RAM uh, there are two slots here so AVU series has got upgradability up to 16 GB on a minimum scale if a 16 plus 16 GB is available in the market, you can upgrade the RAM up to 32 GB also. So just need to use your two hands and uh, there are these two notches. The memory will be relieved. It's a DDR4 uh, 2133 MHz memory that you have to buy. And uh, it's a low voltage memory and uh, it's available in Transcend, Zion, Kingston, Corsair at this point of time. Somewhere around under 2000 rupees here in India. So just take another memory of the similar kind and uh, put it onto this particular notch and uh, you're good to go. This is the CMOS cell. The CPU fan and uh, the processor and the graphics chip I will not get into. This is the Wi-Fi chip here. Just remove this one screw and you can, uh, it's got a very good uh, Intel wide eye chip actually. This my friends was a video showing you how to replace the memory, hard drive, the battery, the Wi-Fi chip, literally everything. Once we open the base, everything is uh, split open for you to take a look at. So HP has done a wonderful uh, job in terms of uh, redesigning the base here. Uh, very minimalistic uh, screw design and you immediately get to the motherboard level. So kudos to HP for this particular model. And I hope you liked our video, do leave some suggestions and comments and don't forget to subscribe to us. You can buy this memory on our website techso.co.in. Thank you so much guys.